Musa Noah Kamara will be dropped from the Lone Star Afcon 2022 squad. This news burst up on social media yesterday as it catches up to the attentions of so many football loving fans. Musa Noah Kamara, alias Musa Tumbo, according to John Kinsta, he said, Bow Ranger striker Musa Noah Kamara, popularly known as Musa Tumbo, will be dropped from the squad to participate in the AFCON 2022 in Cameroon due to indiscipline issue. John Kinsta has expressed dissatisfaction on a gross indiscipline behavior put on by Musa Noah Kamara, who has never shown up in the entire training process since it started almost two weeks ago. According to John Kinsta, he said, I have been calling Musa to know why he has not been showing up for training, but he is to no avail. His colleagues are here training every day while he is in Freetown rejecting my calls. In fact, I even provided him with money when he said he has constraint with financial needs to join the team in Bo. If such behavior continues, I will be left with no option than to drop him from the squad. Musa Noah Kamara also took on to his social media account. Good afternoon, Sigalina, and good afternoon, my people, eh? my fans eh, all over the world. This is when I became Musa Noah Kamara. I do this video for Reti Kista Top of in social media. Reti Kista Top of in social media and I lie. Kista made all her statement and me say it is probably football career. Then, now you have this issue. Kista, now you have it Sunday. For frustrate a young football talent player with the cup. I don't frustrate Boku 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 players in a salon with the cup with the two they get issued on the national team. So it's like nah, you want to have do. But me, I want to have tell and say nothing gave me this year. You know to God. Now I make a kind of the social media for telling people the way they understand me fans they we don't understand. Me fans that we don't understand where the physics say maybe. In a nutshell, Musa Noah Kamara said, This is not the first time we don't kiss that threatening him to end his career. But all what he believes is that John Kista is not God who owns his career. He also denies the allegation that John Kista never called him, neither him receiving any money from John Kista. Then he the told all his fans, me, nah, friends, see, family, brother, nah, sister, see, nah, make, and all those who believe in him that, that this is what exactly it happened. Because, Thank you all, and please subscribe to this channel.